Hello everybody, how are you? I'm going to do something that I'm very, 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 very excited to do. Today is December 31st and we are a few hours until the end of the year here in Japan. And finally, I'm going to do the unboxing of my Hobonichi. The box, uh, sorry, the, the bag still from the shop. They opened a new Hobonichi store in Shibuya inside uh, Parco. And I went there and I purchased this and it was raining. This is why they put you the plastic cover. And I didn't open it until today because I wanted to do the unboxing. But the problem is like my camera set is too close to the thing. Okay. Um, I think for next year, I need to get a new, a new, um, trip. Okay. So first thing I'm going to reveal is like 2020, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I can't talk, ladies and gentlemen, I'm getting the cousin. Ta-da! It looks like crazy, right? Uh, this year, 2019. I sadly didn't use so much my original planner. Um, I think more than half of the pages are empty. And that's very sad for me. But um, I know why. <laughs> uh, besides being busy, I have been low many <laughs> days for many different reasons and I didn't have the help I usually have so I didn't want to push myself to do journal and I didn't want journaling to become kind of like a um, to do thing I wanted journaling to be something that I truly enjoy and because I wasn't in the mood to enjoy anything I didn't use many days but then when I did it, I feel so good that I wanted to keep journaling. So um, finally, this new year, I decided to get cousin because I realized I have more space to play with its stationery. With the original size, it's true that you can fill the pages very quickly. You just write a little bit. You just put a sticker and a little bit of masking tape and it's done. So... That's what I was thinking is going to be good for me. But I became a little bit more, um, how to say, like I always talk too much and I always write too much. But this year I learned to um, reduce the words and express in a more artistically way or say something, I don't know. But I really wanted to play with the stamps and play more with the stationery in my Hobonichi, so I decide to go for cousins so I will get more space in each pages. I'm not going to open this because you, all of you already know how is the Hobonichi cousin. You get first the weekly pages, um, then you get the monthly pages and you get the daily pages and it's uh, really really beautiful um, it has the grid it has the date uh, here with the moon face and also has some a little bit of timetable here and it has the quote in Japanese that I never read because I became lazy to translate it and my Japanese is not as good as to read the quotes as they are so this is the Hobonichi cousin. I'm not going to open it now, but what I'm going to show you is um, that super beautiful store that they open new. They give me a present of this um, Tenugui. They open the shop uh, new. So usually in Japan, uh, they give a special present when they open shops, but that's not a norm is like some shops they like to do that and Hobonichi they like to do that and they did this super beautiful tenugui that is a cotton cloth that is hand printed with a um, silk screen it's really 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 beautiful yeah the Hobonichi store has this duck decoration there on the wall um, this is made by one of the artists that works with Hobonichi so many times doing the pamphlets or other things I also got some 
uh, money. So th this is 100 nuts that equals to 100 yen. And I can spend this uh, in the Hobonichi store um, in Parco or also at Tobichi in Omotesando until May, 31st of May of next year. So yeah, I will use this for some shopping. <laughs> and I love, I really love the bill. I, I feel like I want to keep one, even if it's money, even if it this is 100 yen, that means $1. I want to keep one because that's too pretty. And it's like, they give me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. So the, um, I think they give you one each uh, when you, I don't know how, how is the percentage of calculation. And um, yeah, this is the Hobonichi guide. And I don't know if you already have yours. I don't want to spoil you. I don't want to be... If you didn't see that yet, but I'm not even sure that this is including all the Hobonichis or maybe they give you only at the store because it says Shibuya Parko here. So I can go a little bit slowly if you want to see that again. It says Hobonichi Kalchan. It's kind of like a culture. And I think this duck is the mascot. And this is like Hobonichi. Techo, I don't know. It's like Hobonichi Kalchante. It means like, what is that? So it's the store of the Hobonichi where you can buy uh, Hobonichi products and also some other things about Japanese culture. They had lots of beautiful illustrated books or, I don't know, some purses from uh, some Japanese artists. You can see my video visiting the shop in my channel. And it seems they are going to do some... <laughs> Itosan is here. <laughs> it seems like you can, they can do some events sometimes, so you can enjoy live music or um, art exhibitions, or maybe workshops, or maybe so many surprises they are gonna make for next year. I hope so. So yeah, there's kind of like a explanation also about the shop. Yeah, this is so nice. And they also say that they are going to keep updating their uh, social media. Oh, they're recommending a book here. Oh, what is that? Oh, yeah, so many different they, so many different products that they have there on the shop too. Like, they have this curry. I have tasted it. It's nice. Yeah, it's... Um, in Japan, we have a uh, special Japanese curry. It's not Indian curry. It has a completely different taste. And it's nice. I, pre I prefer Indian curry, but this is very nice. It's kind of like, um, if you have no idea how to make curry, this is very, very, very easy to use. And you get the real Japanese flavor. It's really nice. And then this is also a project, a beautiful thing that Hobonichi made is a... Um, it's a toy that connects with your um, iPhone or or whatever other phone. And you can learn lots of things in Hobonichi Participate. I'll also, my friend uh, Participate giving some information there. And then, yeah, in Parco, there's so many fashion and other type of uh, shops. Something about pets here. Okay, yeah, Hobonichi, they have this page. Yeah, Ito-san is here. Yeah. yeah, and yeah, Hobonichi, you know that they release some fashion items too during the year. So you can see them at uh, Tobichi store and maybe in this store, looks like they were going to bring some things to the store in Parco. That's beautiful. Okay, so they give me another present. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Hobonichi Techo Karta. This is a game we use in New Year's. This is really cool. Um, in Japan, is this card that they have a poem, and one card has for, uh, first half of the poem, the second card has the second half of the poem. So somebody reads the first part, and then you need to catch the second part that is 
on the floor. So it's a it's a game for New Year's. Or oh, there's even professional people that there's competitions about that. So this is the cars. Oh my God. But I think what is written is not the real poems. It's not the Hyakuninshu, Janai, Hyakuninshu. Ah, so Hyakuninshu kedo. These poems are the, mo the 100 most famous po poems in Japan, but I don't know if these are the real po poems or something that Hobonichi made. Okay. Tenji no Akinota no Oh, I think it's the real poem. Just the illustration, it's real. <laughs> and the, the cards are really, 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 really cool. So it's going to be fun to play with this, but I have no idea. Like, I don't know the poems myself. But just to look at the pictures is going to be fun. So, yeah. That's really cool. Really, really cool. Thank you so much. Yay. I'm so happy. And then, of course, I got my pen. My uni pen. These pens are really, really good. I really like this, <coughs> this uni ones because they dry so quickly. They write very smoothly. They are really amazing. They have three colors, so it's really bendy. But, <laughs> sorry, I'm talking Japanese. <coughs> They're really practical. But um, to write in my Hobonichi, I prefer to use a fountain pen or sarasa pen. So, um, I don't know. Um, I think writing with white, uh, or black or blue is okay. But I want to do some something a little bit more crazy, more fancy. So, I like to use a little bit more crazy colors or something like that. And then finally, I'm, if you're still here, <laughs> I'm going to rebuild the cover. I bought a cover. Ta-da! This is the cover for my Kobonichi cousin. Let me show you this super beautiful thing. Look at that. It's so pretty. It's the cover that's called... Oh my god. I think it's called The Lake. I don't know how they translate that to English. But this is a lake in Hokkaido. The island in the north of Japan. And I've been to Hokkaido twice in my life. Once, the first time I visited Japan, almost 20 years ago. Second, last year. <laughs> and... I love Hokkaido so much. It's a huge place. Uh, it has momongas. It has uh, momongas flying squirrels. It has foxes. And it has lots of super beautiful animals. Um, to climb, to hike the mountains of Hokkaido, you need to be in a very good shape. Because... There's not so many easy mountains or beginner's mountains there. So my health, it's not good this year. And one of the reasons is I got on weight a lot. And I could say easily that it was because I didn't do enough exercise or because maybe I ate too many snacks. I don't know. But... I plan to become more healthy again and go to Hokkaido and visit this lake. This is one of my goals for next year. So when I saw this cover that <laughs> is featuring the lake that my friend was talking to me about and showing me the photos, I was like, uh, I think I need to get this cover. Also, um, as you know, I'm not uh, the kind of person that buys the Hobonichi covers. I just buy one and customize every year. So for me, it was a very unusual thing to do. But um, I think this is very easy to customize too. Like, you know, sometimes I have crazy ideas. And when I saw this like that, it's like, oh man, I can't wait to draw a Nessie and put it here or some dinosaurs on the mountain so this is very fun to customize too and 
I can't really wait to use this thing. So thank you so much for all of you to have been following me this year, to having watching my videos. I know my channel is very small, but um, I know many of you really enjoy the videos because my videos are a real disaster. I don't even know how to edit, so I do them on live. And you leave many beautiful comments. Even sometimes I don't even notice you comment and it takes me two, three weeks to answer you still very nice to me so thank you so much to all of you i hope you're still enjoying my videos for next year and i plan to do so many little stationary videos so i hope you follow me and stay with me enjoying stationary japanese stationery. so thank you so much to all of you i wish you a wonderful 2020 full of health happiness and free time to enjoy with stationery thank you so much bye bye happy new year